Welcome to Agile Tech Channel. My name is Christian Drieling. I'm Senior Systems Engineer at Agile Technology. And in this video, I want to show you how to roll out software with our unified management agent. What are we going to see in this video? First, I will show you where you can get some partial updates for special clients to for our management agent. And the next step will be to implement the partial updates to our management server. And as a last step, how to roll out the partial updates to our unified management agent. Where to get our partial updates from Eagle? You can just go to myigil.biz. Then you find the Eagle unified management agent, Windows 7. And here's a folder, partial updates. In this folder, you will find the f partial updates for Citrix receiver for the Horizon client in 32-bit and 64-bit. And also, you will find installation manuals where all the steps we are going through in this video also are documented. And you will find any information that you need for rolling out, for example, the Citrix receiver. And then you just download the PU Citrix receiver for this demo here. Download and then put it to your UMS server. So I've put the download to the desktop of my management server. Right click it, extract it. And then you have a folder with several files in it. Now we have to put the folder PU receiver in the directory product into our built-in web server. So just go to the installation directory of our Agile UMS, Remote Manager, RM GUI server, web apps, UMS file transfer and put it here. And the next step is that you have to download the Citrix installation file from Citrix directly. In the documentation, you will find the information where to download the correct version and which name it has to have. And I prepared already the download, so I will go to Downloads, copy my Citrix receiver, I'm going to the IGEL web server, RM GUI server, web apps, UMS file transfer, Citrix receiver, and put it into the target directory and partial update one. That's the first step of the preparation. The next step is to import the profile to our management server. So go on system, import, import profiles, go to the location where you have put the partial update zip file. And then we have the folder IGEL profiles. And here you can just import the profiles that are needed for the partial update. The next step is to configure the download in the profile PU Citrix receiver. Go to system, update, partial update. And here you can specify your IGEL management server. You have to change the username and the password. And now we have prepared everything that we need. So we can just start to add the profiles to the thin client. And now I will give the information to the thin client about the new partial update. On the system, you see there's a new system configuration available. Click yes. On this moment, nothing will happen to the system. We have to trigger the firmware update now from our UMS. So just go right click Agile PC in my case and say, OK, please do the partial update. And now you see that there's a firmware update available and it's requested by the management server. And if we click yes, the installation of the Citrix receiver will start and it will reboot and then we will see that there's a Citrix receiver on the system.
Thanks for your attention. If you have any questions, feel free to ask our pre-sales support or take a look to IGEL eDocs. Have a nice day.